Uh, Alright, JP Direwolf Gaming here for one more video. Um, this is actually the last Atlas station. This will be number 10. So, pretty much gonna go up here, get my last Atlas stone. And you wanna keep all of your Atlas stones. So you get 10 of them. Because... Uh, very important to not sell them. So I'm not gonna understand a fucking word it says, because I didn't get Atlas's language. But my journey is complete. I went in and the seeds gravitate towards the doorway. I realize what is about to happen if I let it. So Apparently I only have nine. So let me put ten. I guess technically this would be the eleventh. You collect ten and then you reach the last one and then you birth a new star. Galaxy and your traveler will awaken there. Released, free to explore. Yep. So now I am free of Atlas. No longer do I have to follow the bastard. Now I can pretty much just focus on going to the center of the galaxy, which is the better to do the Atlas path first if you want to make it to the center of the galaxy quicker because exactly what that just said it's about black holes so now whenever you get to the galactic map as soon as I get out here it will show anomalies It will show black holes. So, just to give you an example. Black hole. The, every one of the stars that has that black thing on it is a black hole. Black hole. So you can free roam as much as you really want to, but black holes will always show up now to where you can just. Oops. You can just select a black hole and go to it. Like where this one is, is fucking far away from where I am, way over there. but I can travel to it and it's a black hole there's another black hole so that's the best part about doing the atlas path is now you have every black hole mapped you can see them at any time so yeah path towards a black hole so this will just take me to the closest one but I could go to that one to the left if I wanted to. It really doesn't matter. I mean, black hole is a black hole. They take it closer to the to the center. But yeah, that's the yeah, Atlas path finished. So now I don't have to worry about it. Now it's just bouncing from black hole to black hole to get to the center, which is 179,000 light years away. So thanks for tuning in.